Mayor stands by cops involved in subway police shooting, chastises critics. Mayor Eric Adams on Tuesday continued to praise two NYPD officers behind a police shooting on a Brooklyn subway platform last week that left four people, including one of the cops involved, injured. Hesner also blasted those who have been critical of the officer's actions following the release of body camera footage of the incident last Friday that somewhat contra contradicted the NYPD's original narrative of how the incident unfolded. The body cam video shows that the two cops shot 37-year-old Darrell Mickles multiple times after they pursued him on September 15 for entering the Sutter Avenue subway station in Brooklyn without allegedly paying the $2.90 fare and refusing to drop a knife. But the incident also resulted in one of the officers and two bystanders getting shot, leaving one man, 49-year-old Greg Gregory Del Pecci, with brain damage. Adams continued to broadly defend the officers handling of the incident during his weekly news conference on Tuesday and instead took aim at their critics. It is very easy to look back and look at the video where you can hit pause, you can hit stop, you can hit delay, you can go and get something out of the kitchen and come back and look at it again. That's not real life, Adam said. The person who had the knife ran towards the police officer. Those officers several times attempted to say, drop the knife, drop the knife, drop the knife. While NYPD brass and the mayor and the mayor have continued to insist that the officers show restraint in only shooting Mickles when he charged at them. And after they failed to talk him down and subdue him using their tasers. The edited body camera video tells a slightly different story. It shows that although Mickles did refuse to drop the knife and briefly charge at one of the officers, they shoot him. They shot him at a moment when he was standing still with his arms at his sides and his back against the train. In light of the footage, police reform advocates have charged that Mickles did not pose a threat at the moment of the shooting, which they argue could have been avoided. Still, Mayor Eric, sorry, still Mayor Adams insisted that the cops did what they were trained to do by using their tasers, which did not appear to have an effect on Mickles before using their firearms. He added that they did their job by stopping Mickles, who has an extensive rap sheet from hurting anyone with that knife. This is a person that has been arrested over 20 times that we could talk of, Adams said. He had a clear mission to carry out a violent act. And I thank God that those officers took the necessary precautions. Mickles 
pleaded not guilty from his hospital bed on Friday morning. In, in Friday morning, to charges included attempted aggra attempted aggravated assault on a police officer, possession of a weapon, and skipping his subway fare. That's all I have to say for this video.